In this short video, we will discuss about request body search or query DSL in Elasticsearch. To quickly get started with request body search, I would simply head to my Kibana console and I will send a get request to my index which is called user and I will send a underscore search request. The get request will have a body and yes, get requests can carry a request body where I will say that I have a query and the query is of type match and what do I want to match here? I want to match a certain field where my field name is name and the text that I want to match is say Mike. I send this request to Elasticsearch and index not found. Okay, uh, we did not index our search data. So our index was not created. Now our index gets created and I send this request and indeed we find the document where the name is Mike. Let's see one more example of the same thing. Let me try to get all of the people where the job description has a term like vice. I send this request and indeed, yes, I retrieve all the terms where I have all the documents where I have the term vice in the job description but here I see that I also have the term wise in a document in the name field but I do not retrieve that document over here what I can do for that is I can just say that give me all such documents where the name has the text wise and yes I get all these documents but I miss out on all of these documents so how to solve this problem for that, we'll ask Elasticsearch for not a match query this time, but what is called a multi-match query. A multi-match query can essentially do search for you on multiple fields. Here, I would like to say that my query or the term I want to query is vice and the fields that I want to query on fields would be name as well as job description. I send this request to Elasticsearch and yes, I have four records. In my first doc, I can see that the name is vice and in the rest of them, the job description has the term vice. Let us very quickly also discuss what is query DSL. I'll head straight to the query DSL documentation page from Elasticsearch official docs. And here I can read that Elasticsearch provides a full query DSL, which is a domain specific language based on JSON to define our queries. So essentially what that, that means is that whatever problem we will be modeling in Elasticsearch, it will be specific to a particular domain. So Elasticsearch provides us this syntax by which we can send Elasticsearch domain specific JSON so that it can serve our domain specific requests. And that is simply what query DSL means. You can read more in depth about the match query as well as the multi match query from their official documentation. Here it says that match query returns document that match a provided text, number, date or boolean value. We already saw that. A multi match query builds on the match query to allow multi field queries. And that is essentially how a request body search takes place in Elasticsearch. In further videos, we will discuss how we can enhance the request body search and how we can tinker with our search results. That's going to be it for this time. If you find the content of this video helpful, please do click the like button. And if you find the content of my channel helpful, please do click subscribe. You can also hit the bell icon so you don't miss any new updates. And like always, thanks a lot for watching.